so Mike wants to know if he's missing anything that he should be addressing. So for Mike, is there anything missing? And Mike, I'm seeing you with your hand over your eyebrows and you're looking out at the horizon and you are just being so vigilant. In fact, that's what you're being too vigilant. More relaxing, Mike. Don't try so hard. It doesn't have to be an effort. It's, it's when you get into that effort again that you're blocking what they're trying to show you. So just remember again, breathe, relax, allow. You don't have to work hard for the people and the things to come into your awareness that you are desiring to serve. It's, Metatron had a talk with me about this recently because I was frustrated. I'm saying, Metatron, I'm showing up every month and I only get a handful of people. Why are not more people coming? Because this is a fabulous service and they need it. I know they need it. Why aren't they showing up? And it was like, okay, down girl, it's all right. I'm bringing the ones who need to be here. Just relax, allow, don't worry about it. So Mike, I feel that, that pull in your heart and that desire, that big desire to serve. And just know it's all perfect the way it is. Those who need what you have to offer, who are seeking you out, are coming, they're being guided to you. Can't force it. We just have to breathe, relax, allow, and let them to come to us in the right timing because that's the other thing there's that right timing you know they're not always ready at the time that here we are waiting to give to them so we have to be patient and we just have to do what we can in each moment and be okay with that relax into it and know that what we're doing is perfect okay it looks like you put a message in there for me If you want to unmute yourself, Mike, and respond, that's fine. Oh, I, I, I did unmute myself. Okay. What you said is exactly what I was expecting. I just wanted to be certain that I was on track. Because yeah. while everybody's panicking everywhere, I just received their calls and put their fires out. And it, it's, everything's just very peaceful within me, regardless of all the other stuff. And that's perfect. That's how it should be. You are the anchor right now for those people who are panicking and who need that help. So I want you to know, I almost wrote this to you guys and then I took it out because I didn't want to go negative. But, you know, I had two days this week where I just gave myself permission to say, you know, stop the world. I want to get off because, you know, Mike, here we are, we're serving, but sometimes we have to serve ourselves. So don't forget that self-care. Mm -hmm. yeah. So you know, I just, I had a lot of stuff to do. I really didn't have the time to spare, but I needed to do that so that I could be ready today to serve in whatever way that I could serve. So I took those two days and I just watched YouTube videos and shut the world out and, you know, took that mental, spiritual break so that I could come back. And I, I have been doing that also. Yeah, and, that, it, and, and when I come back, I'm refreshed and I'm able to do more more expediently yeah and that's so important so for those of us who are serving in this capacity it's really important to be kind to yourself to serve yourself first so that you will have more to offer to others and you know sometimes we get so involved in helping that we do forget to take care of ourselves and then we're going to get depleted and we'll be able to help fewer people so really important i'm so glad you're doing that mike but now is the time when you're going to be needed more than ever. So do that self-care and be ready and just be that rock, be that anchor because you've been practicing for this and you've been doing this for decades. And now it's really hitting the fan and getting more real than ever before. Life as we knew it is, is no longer, it's a whole different paradigm. So we're being called to come forward to develop our own sea legs really fast so we can help other people to strengthen their own sea legs. Thank you. You're so welcome. Thanks for being here.